Hawker. <laughs> this announcement is for fourth and fifth grade. I want you guys to realize that coming home, and actually it's really for everybody, because when you get to fourth and fifth grade, you'll get in there. But today, on that email that comes out every day, oh, darling, crisscross applesauce hands are that, Christian. You can do it. All right, so today, on that marvelous email that comes out every day, there's going to be an application for robotics. But this year, hi darling, thank you. Want me to hold it? Okay, thank you. Okay, it's in the left side. Can you help remember left side? This is the left. Okay. All right, so robotics this year is a club and a team. It's a little bit different. We're gonna, last year we did it as a club. This year we're doing it as a club and a team. You still fill out your application of who you are and how you feel about yourself, but there's also that really important letter you have to get from, a, from one of your teachers that recommends you. And this time on March 17th, we're going to competition. So our robotics teams, and there will be five of them, we will be going to a competition in March. So it's a club team. It's a little bit different than last year. And third graders, get ready, because next year you can be part of it. And second graders, second graders, in two years you can do it. And first graders, in three years you can do it. And kindergartners, you're like four years away. But you can do it then too. So think about it. All right, it's in the daily memo. Did you find your book talk person? Who are we looking for? There he is, come on down! What do I say? And I have a monster book, a monster truck book from Ms. Hamilton. Do other people get books from Ms. Hamilton? It's about monster trucks and some of them, one of them will call Bigfoot and, and the other one's called Some of them are called some of them are called crazy stuff. And the and there's a major monster truck. I say And there's a monster truck that has uh, it's a whale. And they took it off. Mr. Frank. 
Francis and I, we have a couple different things we are needing to do this morning. And so we'll start with our band. And the class, I was having trouble picking a class this week for the, for the music banner. And then <clears throat> I had a class come to my room and they made me so happy. I think it was Miss Hamilton that last week said a class just made her heart so happy. Because this class, they, they showed such kindness to each other and they stayed involved in the lesson. And they truly, I could see and feel the friendship and they were trying to help, it, help each other. And this class goes to third grade class and it goes to Miss Hoskins class. So let's give them a husky chip. In PE, we are doing a lot of teamwork activities where we are partnering up with just one partner and then we are partnering up with two partners and creating big groups. And this primary class came in and they synergized very well. And this primary class is Miss Lindo's classroom. So let's give them a big husky chip. Lily, 
Lily, put your stuff down. Come up here. All right, so like Ms. Manier said, she, um, she is new to the Leadership Awards, and so am I. So what I was looking for in the PE Leadership Award was somebody that came in, they accomplished what I asked them to do, they used the seven habits in PE, as well as showed good sportsmanship. And these students, these friends, was who I picked with the Leadership Awards. Again, come up here. There are two. One is to take home. One is for a leadership binder. Your leadership binder, and at the end we will do a big husky cheer for them. In kindergarten, I have Braxton Klaus and Chloe Conley. In first grade, I have Carter Payne and Piper Faulkner. Second grade, uh, we have a system. In second grade, I have Clark Powers and Alexis Eisenman. In third grade, I have Nolan Retz and Kylie Clark. Fourth grade, I have Isaiah Irwin and Nina Madadi. And in fifth grade, I have Christopher Burns and Ruby Robinson. These are your PE Leadership Award winners. Let's give them a big husky cheer. Ooh, I think by the second round, we finally got that down. Awesome. Congratulations to all of our leaders in PE and music. We are so proud of your hard work and your practicing of the seven habits outside of your home and classroom. Okay, I think we're ready for our pledges. Please sit up straight. Please sit up straight. I will. 